Are you safer than ever in East Nashville? Well, that part of town experienced some of its lowest crime rates in recent history in 2016. News Channel 5's Jesse Knudsen joins us live from the East Precinct. And Jesse, while crime is down, there's still work that needs to be done. Absolutely, Rory, but crime is down more than 7% over here in East Nashville in the past year, so police are making quite the dent, but still, crimes happen every single day. I'm Chris Griggs, Robert Hodge. Thank you. Every week, a group of East Nashvillians gather with police to talk about what's going on in their neighborhood. So the biggest way we can bat it is try to give extra patrols to the areas you're talking about. And at this meeting, there was good news to report. Crime was down 7.5% in the East Precinct from 2015 to 2016, making this past year one of the safest statistically in East Nashville's history. And if you look at the crime statistics, the numbers are drastically lower than they were 10 years ago. We saw an all-time reduction in violent crime. We saw an all-time reduction in street robberies, an all-time low in aggravated assaults, and in residential burglaries this year. Well, that's good news. It doesn't mean that crime does not exist. Just this week, two East Nashville businesses and their customers were robbed at gunpoint, including Drifter's Barbecue on Tuesday. Uh, it wasn't just the bar or the business that was a victim. There was other victims there as well. Luckily, no one was hurt, and the suspect was caught on surveillance cameras at the Shell gas station on Gallatin Road. Now he ran out the door and went up the street. A crime committed in the middle of the day with little regard to others. You know, it's disturbing. It's unsettling. Robert has been attending these meetings since he moved to Nashville more than three years ago, and he hopes crime will continue to diminish in East Nashville. You know, I got a bullet in my house, you know, I don't like to have a bullet, you know, go into my house. And police say the way to do that is not just good police work, but by having people get engaged in their communities, attending meetings just like this one, and looking out for your neighbors. If you live on a street where there is crime, your quality of life isn't as great as somebody lives on a block without crime. Police say in, in addition to being aware of your surroundings, you can help yourself by hiding any valuables that are in plain sight and locking your cars, especially at night. Live in East Nashville, Jesse Knudsen, News Channel 5.